All right, last game of the night, then, it looks like, will be Mahan. Luxter wants to see Mahan again. That's not a problem. And we'll always happily play American Destroyers. Let's see. i got to find the right tier. She's down here at 7. Mahan. KU, KU Gamer, thank you for the follow. KY Carol, Huang. Guys, thank you for the follows. I missed those earlier. I apologize. All right. I think we've just played this ship just as she is, so we'll just go again. That Leningrad game wasn't very exciting. Um, I think what I learned is that... Um, I think I, 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 I you gotta have you need expert marksmen on that ship. Oof, that felt really bad without expert marksmen. You did. Mm. You crazy son of a bitch, you did. Go away and thank you for the thank you for the sub. I appreciate that. I I love you guys that that sub and and donate anything or whatnot. I really appreciate it. I do this as a hobby, and and that gives me the flexibility to and kind of invest reinvest some money into my setup. Um, I'm looking at some monitor mounts and 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 re, kind of rearranging the desk setup here and and so on. So that's that's really awesome, guys. I really appreciate that. All right, so we're on Shatter as mid tier. The carrier is below me. That feels good. I know what I can do to those planes in a, in a Farragut. Let's see what we can do in a Mahan. Yes, my wife thinks I need a new graphics card, and she's probably right. She's probably right. Yeah, Kaga was in a Magi hull, wasn't she? All right, let me think about this for a minute. We got any radar to deal with? No. They have, they have a Tier 6 cruiser, a Tier 7 cruiser, a boatload of battleships, carrier planes, an Ulan, a Yudachi, a Farragut. Okay, so there's very little things. There's very little here that I'm upset about running into early or that, I, that I'm that i terrified of getting into a gunfight with. So let's just... Cease. Thank you very much. Good night. Have a good one. But yeah, Kaga was built on an Amagi hull. She was a convert. So was, um, wasn't Akagi as well? Wasn't Akagi a converted battlecruiser? If, if memory serves, Hiryu was one of the only, like Hiryu and Shokaku and Zuikaku were some of the only purpose-built fleet carriers in the IJN. They had a ton of, um, they had a ton of ships that were, their carrier fleet, anyway, were a lot of con a lot of conversions, as I remember. All right, the Olans up north. That leaves possibly the Udachi, possibly the Fairgard, possibly the Gallant, or the Gallant, excuse me. I am way out by myself over here, but the carrier seems to be screwing around up north, so I'm actually okay with that for right now. Hmm. It's no big deal, Rage. What you probably... Oh, I have I have RPF on this, Captain. What you probably got confused with is that carriers have no magazines. A carrier in World of Warships cannot detonate. That's very ahistorical, right? That is super mega ahistorical, but it is the case. Carriers... Carriers in real life could absolutely detonate, right? But it just didn't... It um, it absolutely happened in real life. It simply can't happen in World of Warships. Is the Amagi my RPF target? I have to wonder. I feel like if somebody was coming into this cap, they'd have been here by now. I think the Amagi is my RPF target. Or somebody... I don't know. Somebody's down here. No, it's not the Amagi. There's some... There's a cruiser or something down here on the bottom end of the cap. In a moment, we're going to go find out what. Well, now we know what. See, now I'm in a much better spot because... Carrier's going to have to come into the A bubble 
of everybody if he wants Power to deal on. with me. Now it's time to kick some ass. That's fine. I'm gonna feel that Not one way. of those rocket planes is going home, so I'll take it, kids. Uh, much better. Enjoy your fire, sir. In fact, I'm going to slow down right here so I can keep pummeling you. Careful, you might catch some torpedoes. No, no torpedoes for you. Feels bad. I honor your persistence, Mr. Spey. Unfortunately, you are dead. You simply haven't figured it out yet. All right. Fair gets down south. Can I beat him in a gunfight? I feel like I ought to be able to beat him in a gunfight. He's going to come around with some torpedoes. Let's get over there so we can play a little defense. See my flat doing good work. That feels good. Nope. Mamaki, you blew those, son. That's not how you do that. Yeah, we need to go deal with this Farragut. I gotta make sure he stays away from my battleships. Our Icarus killed in Alabama? What is happening in this game? Who is over there? Hmm. It's three on four down here, and it's like eight on two up north. Where the hell is the rest of their team? <laughs> Make my day. Thank you for the follow. All right, so the Farragut, or the Moggy, has looped into the cap? Who's in this cap? It's got to be the Gallant. It's got to be the Gallant. No, okay. Oh, the Moggy's coming in. No, he stopped. I liked it better when he was pushing up. I had, I had all the torpedoes ready for him. Come on, Amagi. Come on, Amagi. You know you want it. Turn off my A. I don't want to get spotted when I wasn't. Come on, Amagi. What's up, Warl? How you doing, buddy? Come on, Amagi, turn your engines on. Yes. Yes. Do it. Do it slowly. Do it, Dulcimo. See you later, alligator. What I want to know is, where's my buddy the Farragut? Where did that guy go? I'm doing something really stupid. I really shouldn't be down here. Oh, True Lies is a brilliant movie. Might actually kill the Amagi. Mm. Sucks to be you, dude. Where is my buddy the Farragut? Huh. Well, this Amagi is going to learn to curse my name in a moment. It's going to be pure comedy. Yeah, it was the Gallant. This team is getting just annihilated. Ah, there you are. What is up, my dude? It is totally time for you to die. Yep. Very time for you to die. What's up? Surprise! You just thought I was dead. 
You thought wrong, dude. Weird ram, but okay, sure. I'm gonna kick your ass, bitch. New Mexico's still in my gun range. Let's harass him. Why not? Nothing better to do while I sit back here and cap. Yeah, I was expecting those, but he didn't get much out of them. Fly me to the moon, let me play among the stars. Alright, that's enough That's enough trolling. Let's go kill this gallant. Our victory is in sight. You know, uh, there was a time, I forget who it was that I was talking to. I think it was, I think it was Duck, one of the, was Duck Boy or Ducky Shot? I cannot remember because I always get them backwards. But one of them was super high on this ship. Talking about how awesome it was. And I was like, you are on crack. Because I remember when Mahan was trash. And Mahan is not trash anymore, guys. Let's just put it that way. She's got 9km torps now. Yes, they're slow. But a lot of the battleships in her tier bracket are also slow. So it works out okay. She's just, she's got a lot going for her. She is not a bad ship. This Bayern's going for the Ram. I don't think he's going to get it, though. No, that ain't a thing. That is not a thing that's going to happen. Let's see if I can steal this New Mexico kill. Negative. Steal the Galant kill. Steal the Galant kill. Steal the Galant kill. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, give me better dispersion than that. Come on. Ah, well. A win's a win. Um... So recon, you're not. You're partly right. Like the mid, most mid-tier destroyers are legit terrible when they are um, bottom tier, because everybody else probably certainly somebody in the game gets the stealth, gets the concealment mod, and you don't. So that feels like crap. Um, if there are other tiers, like a game like this, this is a mixed game, right? Like I got eights and I got sevens and I got sixes. So the um, the Ulan, for example, would grossly outspot me and has a heal. Like, that's something that, that I don't want to get in a gunfight with, but I have other things. I can do other things that, that, that he can't, right? I, I I have smoke. He doesn't, right? So you're welcome, Luxter, anytime. I love Mahan. Like, this is I, pretty much all American destroyers. One of the reasons that I haven't reground this line is that I don't want to give him up. The idea of selling back my Fletcher is a, so abhorrent to me, right? I just, I, I don't... I, I can't imagine a world where I can't go, you know what, I need to fletch your game. I just push a button. I don't want to regrind the line. Um, so that's that's why I haven't done it. I'm I'm more than anything, I just I don't want to sell them back. They're fun ships to play, but I don't want to give them up. You can have my Fletcher when you pry it out of my cold dead fingers. It wasn't the first line I ground wrote, but it was once I discovered the joy of playing these, um, it's it was it was one of the one of the ones I finished early on, for sure, for sure. Nineteen hundred base. That's not too shabby. A lot of capping points in that game. Yeah, I had two full caps and a partial. Didn't get a ton of work out of the AA, but the Ranger left me alone, so I consider that a win. <laughs> 